Hey everyone, I don't actually have a comparison video today. So today when I went to the grocery store, I found this right here. The Nestle Kit Kat Classic. And the price tag was about $4.50 ish. I wonder is the quality any different? So so I picked it up, so I'm just gonna be trying it on in front of the camera for you guys to see me. And we'll see how it goes. So the packaging as compared to the regular Kit Kat, well aside from the size, the material for the wrapper is sort of a smooth instead of glossy. It looks really nice. So surprisingly enough that as compared to the standard size Kit Kat bars that they don't have that ribbon where you just tear it open and that ribbon will guide it, you know what I mean? This one here is pretty similar to the American Hershey Kit Kat. You just actually open it up from the back. So we're going to give this a try. I'm so excited. So we're going to give this a try. I'm so excited. Yeah, just letting you know Kit Kat is like my favorite bar, even though it's just a simple wafer chocolate bar, but it is simple and it's good. It's not overpowering, overly sweet, and I really enjoy eating it. Now, just letting you know, even though I've been doing so many food reviews like on junk food, I'm not a real big junk food eater. Uh, just pointing that out. <laughs> I just wanted to compare... Um, different types of bars that may taste or look similar. So that's one of my points for my own video, uh, for my doing videos. So, uh, yes. So back to this. Oh! So you can actually re-close it. This is really cool. So if you want to just have a stick or two, you can just reseal it and put it away until next time. This is how I like to open it and reseal it. I don't have to worry about chocolate going everywhere. Might be a little melty because the heat is like plus 20 here and I'm dying of heat. So they're actually sort of divided into half sticks, which is kind of cool. The European versus the Canadian version. The European has that oval shape behind the Kit Kat logo, you see right here. The Canadian version just has Kit Kat, much like the American. So the Kit Kat Canadian has the same font as the European, hence Nestle. <laughs> it's so nasty. Okay. I'm trying to break a stick off. Sorry, it's so melty. Mmm. It is different than a regular Kit Kat. The wafer is sort of softer. The chocolate seems like a better quality than just a regular Kit Kat. So this whole thing is 170 grams. Ah, it's imported. That explains it. So it must be made from Switzerland, I'm guessing, where the headquarters must be. So yeah, that was pretty good. It tastes basically like the Canadian Kit Kat, but just the wafer is a um, little bit softer and the chocolate seems a little bit better quality than what we get. I'm so jealous. But something I really probably wouldn't pay $4.50 for personally, but I just wanted to pick it up just to show you guys and hey, I care for you guys. You guys are awesome. So yeah, that's about it. So hit the like button below and subscribe for more videos. So that's about it guys, so hit the like and subscribe button, I'll talk to you later.
Bye.